Hey guys, Chris Tomlin here. We are at a KS Bar and I'm here with JP Cole and he's with the Sports Collectible Roadshow. It is going to be at Hilton Garden Inn out of Hamburg this weekend. And JP, tell us a little bit about what the what your show is like and what people can come out and talk to you about. So we, we come all the way from the West Coast and what we do is we set up at the uh, Hilton Garden Inn and we do appraisals and buying of vintage sports collectibles. So if you have any pre-1975 autographs, game used uh, items of any type of sports. Autographs could be Americana, presidential, Hollywood, um, baseball, football, all the sports, and, and sports cards. Sports cards is a big hot item right now. If you want to find out what your sports cards are worth, uh, if you want to sell them, we're there to give you an appraisal and give you feedback uh, this weekend. So starting tomorrow from nine to four and each day at the same time. Tell us a little bit what, about some of the items you brought today. So I brought a, just a variety of a few different things that we kind of look for, specifically sports cards. They're all laying right here, but I'll, I'll hold them up. These are just old, vintage, you know, in this case, baseball cards. We do some hockey cards. Uh, we're looking for pre-1975 sports cards, and we will tell you what they're worth. We'll make you an offer if that's what you want. In addition, we also look for autograph stuff. So we have a a really nice Babe Ruth autograph ball that we brought. We got Derek Jeter's game used glove uh, with us. We brought a bat that was used by Babe Ruth in 1930. It's fully authenticated. It's a game used bat and uh, it's, it's kind of a museum piece. We love bringing this out and getting the people to hold it and see the reaction when, they, when they're physically taking a picture of holding with it. Even if we don't buy something from them or they don't get the right information, not the right information, get the information they want to hear mm -hmm. as far as what their items are worth, they at least get an experience and say that I you know, held Babe Ruth's bat. And now, obviously in this market, we don't have a lot of professional sports, but we do have the Derby, we have the Wildcats, we have Muhammad Ali from Kentucky. Are these the kind of things that if you have items uh, centered around those, those figures or those sports that you might want to bring out? Yeah, you could bring um, anything out. We really focus in on the pre-1975. Uh, however, if you have something that's after that, we'll, and we'll take a look at it for you. Um, but for the stuff that we specialize in, it's pre-1975. Definitely Muhammad Ali is a, is a popular collectible that we, we uh, deal with. And, you know, if you have a robe of his signed or a photo or, a, or even a glove, bring it on out. We'd love to take a look at it. We're going to have you look at some of the artifacts we have here at KS Bar. Right here is an autographed Jeff Shepard jersey from 98 of the entire team. Coach Smith, everybody on there. What kind of advice would you give us on this? It's definitely one of those types that um, is worth a lot of money because of the championship year. The autographs are all nice, nicely done. They stand out, uh, which is a which is a good thing, and I'm sure this is kind of a museum glass piece that protects the autograph. I would always encourage people, if they do have something that's autographed, make sure it stays out of lights, or at least you have the right type of framing and, and glass to, to make sure it doesn't fade away. I've seen so many amazing pieces, and the autographs just disappear over time. All right, now JP, Kentucky's favorite son, obviously, is Anthony Davis. We sure. have a few things here. This is the Davis and Gilchrist sign poster. We have the famous uh, Anthony Davis uh, uh, 2012 shot there. Tell us about Anthony Davis stuff. Well, his stuff is, is obviously very popular in this area, okay? But it's also popular throughout the country. I mean, he is one of the top ball players. While a current ball player is, is hot, it's one of those pieces that would be of interest to everybody in the country, okay? And he is what I would call a hot ball player. So we're gonna be there Friday through this Sunday, nine to four. Come on down, bring your stuff. It's easy parking, easy in and out. We'll, we'll sit with you and give you some really good feedback. Yeah, so go through your stuff, find out what you have, bring them out here to JP. He'll take a look at them. He will tell you how much they're worth. That's the Sports Collectible Roadshow at Hamburg this weekend. Go out and see JP.